Good morning guys, it's just 4, it's 20 past 4, the sun has officially risen now. Today we're going to head to some of the touristy spots in Iceland without any tourists. Let's see how it goes. So uh, I live in Iceland but I'm no Icelander, I'm just a sorry Brit, just run away from his country. So I feel like in order to get the full experience of, of being in Iceland, I need to have an Icelandic person with me. <laughs> That's a proper Icelandic man right there. <laughs> oh, he's gone. So the first stop on our tour is Thingvetle. Am I saying that right, Mr. Icelandic man? Uh, say it again. Thingvetle? No, no, no. Say it again. Thingvetle. Thingvetle. Yeah. And as you can see, there is no one here, which is the plan. I don't know why I fucking said yes to this idea. I should be sleeping right now. Yeah, I don't think I don't think you've actually slept, slept have you? No, I haven't. So yeah, we're gonna head up to the waterfall and see and see it. Do you think it will be better or worse with people here? Um, well, I do like people, uh, but no, I don't think so. But doesn't it blow like every hour or something? No, like every two minutes or so. Oh, okay. I haven't seen it. Next stop is Geyser. The time is... It's, it's 25 past 6, so I think maybe there'll be a few people here, but we'll see. We'll see how early people, how early, how, uh, how many birds are catching worms. The next stop and our final destination is Good Foss. Yes. 
the time is, it's just gone past seven o'clock and there's still no one here. having the waterfall to yourself. Okay Bjorgen, you've seen all the destinations with zero people. Yeah. How was it? Um I really enjoyed my experience and if I would have to put it in one word that word would be um, 